eye over a mob mystery. The FBI digging up the area behind a Providence factory for the body of a Westwood man. They're looking for Stephen DeSaro. He was a South Boston nightclub manager back in 1993 before he disappeared. And now new clues are taking agents to Providence. That's where we find WBZ's Louisa Moeller live tonight. Louisa? Well, Paul Liam, Providence police currently guarding the scene. Of course, the FBI can't say much. It's an active investigation. But today we got a small glimpse of their large-scale operation, including a visit from the medical examiner. On Wednesday, the property behind an old Providence mill was teeming with federal investigators. A large excavator and tarps, more evidence of an FBI dig linked to mob activity. The medical examiner also spent time at the scene. Sources tell our sister station, WPRI, it's a search for the remains of Stephen DeSero, a Boston nightclub operator who prosecutors say was murdered in a gangland slaying in 1993. His body was never recovered. No one has ever been charged with DeSero's murder, but former New England mob boss Francis Cadillac Frank Salemi was indicted in 2004 for making false statements related to what he knew about DeSero's death. A government press release saying, quote, The defendant, Francis P. Salemi, was present at the scene of Stephen DeSero's murder. The defendant also assisted in burying Stephen DeSero's body to prevent its discovery. The FBI remaining tight-lipped, only saying there's no threat to the public, while local residents are in awe. I've lived in this house for 30, 38 years and no problems at all. And then I find out there's some kind of a gangland shooting. It seemed just like a dark history in Providence past that might be coming back or it could be from a previous time, but we'll find out. Now, back in August, federal investigators actually raided this property for an illegal marijuana growing operation. They arrested the complex owner, William Ritchie, but there is no evidence that Ritchie's case is related to this dig. Live in Providence, Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.